to me, the big screaming headline is lawyers are not perfect. Yeah. And that's a surprise. I know. Who's going to tell them? <laughs> this is the assumption of every conversation I've been in. We cannot trust these tools. We are alone the ones who are perfect and unflawed. And already, less than three years into this era, we're basically on par with these tools. And they're going to get better. Yes. We're not. At least not before I retire, I would no. imagine. Mm -mm. And the most useful piece of data that I'm including in every presentation I do now, we are very, very flawed and imperfect. Yeah. And they're getting better and they're pretty much where we are. One of the things lawyers need to do is sometimes think of creative solutions to problems, but that's one of the places where the tools really excel. The tool is not going to be hungry. It's not going to have the biases that humans just have that we bring to the table when we do a task. I think the big takeaway was we have to now start talking about as opposed to what, as Andy Perlman puts it, what do we have right now when you're comparing these tools? 